Through this tutorial, you will learn about some of the basic structure tools found in Microsoft Word 2010. In this tutorial, you will learn how to use styles, headings, and a table of contents to enhance the accessibility of your Word documents. Microsoft Office provides users with pre-created styles. These can be found in the Home tab on the top bar. These styles help to quickly attach certain attributes to text in your documents. These styles can greatly enhance the readability and accessibility of your content. To apply a style to a section of text, simply select the desired text and choose the style type you would like it to be attributed to. Headings are the style type that you will be using the most frequently in Microsoft Office. These styles define your section headers and their sequential order, the order that the text will be read by a screen reader. Using proper headings in your documents greatly improves the accessibility of your content, as well as providing excellent organization. When you simply make text look like a heading by using bolding, underlining, or font size, it may appear to be a heading, but it is read by a screen reader as any other text. You must use the provided heading styles to define text as a heading. How to define text as a heading. Select the text you want to define as a heading. Select Heading Style. Make sure to nest your headings in their proper logical order. Sometimes, the basic style and heading options may not fit the styling of your overall document. After defining a section of text as a style, it can be altered in any way and it will still be considered to be the chosen style. But, if you are using the same style multiple times in your document, it can become tedious to change each section of stylized text individually. Fortunately, Microsoft Office allows you to modify any style however you would like. How to modify a style. Right click on a style. Select Modify. Make any modifications that you would like. Select either only in this document or new documents based on this template. A table of contents can allow for easier navigation of your content for both students reading your content and those using assistive technologies. Word's Table of Contents tool utilizes the headings and styles you have used throughout your document to instantly create your Table of Contents. How to Create a Table of Contents Place your cursor where you would like your table to be. Select References. Select Table of Contents. Select Table Style. If you add to your document after creating a Table of Contents, you must update the table. How to Update a Table of Contents Select the Table of Contents. Select References. Select Update Table. This tutorial has gone over some of the basic structure tools that can be used to ensure your Microsoft Word content is accessible. Thank you for watching this Microsoft Word accessibility tutorial.